can match the power of a Sith. Your lust for battle can only lead to destruction. Ah, a Jedi. Much better. To destroy a dangerous foe, that is the way of a true Sith. When I carve your heart from your chest, your fellow Jedi will sense your defeat, as will my master. Have you lost your mind? <laughs> Beautiful scum like you cannot oh, we grasp tired. the full nature of the Sith. The power of the dark side is infinite. Are you ready to face oblivion? I'm going to enjoy taking you down. The pleasure will be all mine. Ooh, a fellow Ratataki. <laughs> so basically, you want to uh, take out those ads uh, pretty quickly. Watch out for purple stuff, as always. Keep an eye on your own hit points. Oh. There we go. Ah, charging up our main nothing to it. Batteries. In a few moments, your pathetic ship and all your pathetic friends will be nothing but floating debris. All right. So you can get... Um, so I got a Disruptor's Lightsaber, which is a customizable uh, uh, main hander, which is quite nice. Come on. Get onto the shuttles. We have to hurry. If we launch fast enough, I think we can make it. Are you ready? First Officer Haken doesn't want you to come back from this one, Ambassador. He thinks you'll just cause more trouble. Is this a joke? That spineless, indecisive. He wants you to hand me over to the Imperials? Unbelievable. After everything I've done to save the ship, everything I've done for the Republic, that scum tries to betray me to the Empire. Wait, you didn't actually agree to leave me behind, did you? I wouldn't leave you behind to die, Asara. Good. I was about to... well, it doesn't matter. Come on, we've wasted too much time here already. Let's go. Alright, uh, so yeah, you can still play a fairly dark... Um, Republic person, even a, a Jedi, you know, you can still play a, a fairly dark Jedi, you know, that's perfectly okay. <clears throat> Actually, after playing a little bit of the uh, Jedi Knight uh, playthrough, um, playing dark is actually not that bad. <laughs> One thing I do like about this game is, uh, like, you get to, um, you know, it's not all, you know, just good guys versus bad guys, you know, it's, it's kind of nuanced, uh, you know, some of the, 
some of the choices are, you know, kind of black and white, but uh, you can you can kind of play around a lot with your narrative, Everyone's and aboard, and you do kind of make your own narrative, now. so. We're safe. You did it. You did what no one else could have done. You've saved us all. We owe you our lives. Every one of us. So on behalf of the passengers and crew of the Republic Transport Essimus, thank you. I hope those thanks come with a hefty reward. Of course. Of course. Heroism deserves to be rewarded. I took up a collection from everyone on the ship. Hopefully these credits will help you save other people in need. The same way you saved us. Thank you very much. You deserve far more. Hmm. Well, I don't know about this chick. Ambassador Asara, it's... It's a relief to see that you made it back to us safely as well. Really? I imagine it comes as a bit of a surprise to see me here at all, Hawken. I... I don't know what you mean. Of course I'm glad to see you. Why would you think differently? You offered me a reward to leave her on the Grand Moff's ship, Hawken. You must have misunderstood me. I would I would never. I, I wouldn't do something <laughs> like that. He's a terrible liar. Thank you for telling me the truth. And for everything else you've done here. The Republic needs heroes like you now more than ever. I did what I had to do. Nothing more. I mean it. If you hadn't been here... We would all be dead for certain. I should warn you, though. Grand Moff Kilrun is never going to forget what we've done. He'll stop at nothing to get his revenge. If Kilrun thinks he can take us, he's in for a surprise. Oh, yeah. Be sure to stay alert from now on. <laughs> those hands on those hips, girl. You anyway, do it. <laughs> enough of that. I'd say it's about uh. time we all relaxed a bit and enjoyed the rest of our trip. Thanks again. And good luck in the future. Excellent. Yeah. Okay, so I, I guess we're going back to the uh, um, space station. That's okay. We can just hop the uh, the shuttle and go straight to Coruscant. We don't have to do that again. So we're going to go on and, uh, so you can, like, actually just do this mission immediately again, so. All right. Uh, leave group, quit group. There we go. So we're back in, um, oh, no. Yeah, these you go to in a little, a little later, so. Um, what all did we get? Uh. Unsecure prototype storage case. Let's see what we got. Ooh, a lightsaber. I think this is for um, the. All right, so these are some of our crafting gear. Uh, we got some silica and dash. Um, so let's. I'll show you how this works. So now um, we can make five belts. <clears throat> so, so we're we both use uh, heavy armor, 
So I'll actually go on and tell him... Well, actually, no, I won't do that. <clears throat> uh, oh, wait, we gotta go turn this in first. Wow, this is going to be like a ton of recording. Um, I didn't intend for it to go this long, but uh, yeah, I've been recording uh, about two and a half hours. <laughs> All right, so that uh, mission turn in maybe down here. Oh, wait, there it is. Sometimes they don't, uh, the mission completion things, they, they won't show up on your, your big map sometimes. Um, oh, nice. Oh, man, almost another level. Excellent. Uh, whoops. Uh, weekly searching for allies. Yeah, so you can do that like every every week, I guess. Um, so that gave us uh, a good chunk of uh, basic combinations. So um, that will really help us when we get ready to buy some gear uh, when we get to Coruscant. So I'm going to <clears throat> hop the shuttle down here. It's almost uh, covered up by my overlay, so. <clears throat> wow, so we've gained uh, two two levels. Coruscant Spaceport. Ow. Uh oh, little little graphical glitch there. There we go, Coruscant. The center of the Galactic Republic. And the home of the uh, the Jedi. Well, the Jedi Temple is on Coruscant, but um, I think in in this stage, the, uh, the actual center of the Jedi is on Tython, where uh, um, Shatil Shan is. So. Alright. So is this actually Coruscant? Or is this the uh, space? I think this is the space board. time on a backwater like Ord Mantell, you almost forget what a civilized planet's supposed to look like. I did my officer training here, back before I was deployed to Ord Mantell. There was still a fair bit of reconstruction going on then, rebuilding things the Imperials destroyed. I still can't believe the Empire managed to sack Coruscant back in the war, the capital of the entire Republic, and they raided it like some outer rim mud ball. Seems like the Empire would have tried to hold on to Coruscant. Nah, they didn't bring the numbers to actually take over. It was a psychop. Sack course and scare everyone in the Republic. Get people thinking that nobody's safe. Anyways, we should get moving. Don't want to keep anyone important waiting. Alright, here we go. I kind of wish they had more, uh, more loading screens, but, uh, yeah, let's grab, let's grab a couple ah, of these missions. Here. It's a great pleasure to meet one of the Republic's finest. I realize you can't discuss it, Lieutenant, but thank you for exposing the traitors on Ord Mantel. Identify yourself. Where are my manners? Forgive <laughs> me. Anatol Ruspar. Coruscant Special Affairs Liaison. I represent Venara Kale, Senator of Coruscant, 
She not only speaks for our capital world in the Galactic Senate, but oversees this planet's government. Senator Kale leads the effort to rebuild what was destroyed during the Sith Empire's invasion. Healing those old wounds has been slow and painful. <laughs> Get to the point. This world faces many a crises. A shattered infrastructure, a booming refugee population, whole sectors descending into anarchy. All of these hinder the rebuilding. Senator Kale believes you're specially qualified to deal with a dangerous and urgent threat. She'd appreciate the favor of a meeting. Immediately. How long have you loitered around the spaceport waiting for my shuttle? My time is the Senator's time. And I never wait for long. Senator Kale is the greatest leader we've had in decades. She'll not only rebuild this world, but the rest of the Republic with it. Speak to Minister uh... Immo at the Senate Tower. Tell him you're expected. Good luck, and welcome to Coruscant. Ah, we leveled up. Excellent. So now we just got to find a trainer. Mm -mm. Um, we're going to grab this fast travel. Um. So, uh, yeah, Kursan is uh, basically a giant city the size of the planet. <clears throat> gonna grab this uh I think I actually already know this Vehicle one. Vehicle paths yeah. are currently open for business. Uh this is I think these are uh flashpoint couriers, uh party missions. Uh searching for allies, emerging conflicts. Uh hammer station and Athos, we don't have those yet, so uh, well, I mean, we could queue for them, but they're, they would be very difficult to do. Um, and they would expect me to be, like, an actual healer, which would be too tough, I think. Uh, this is a great outquest. Uh, strongholds. Oh, yeah, the stronghold thing. Uh, I don't think I showed any of that. I think I actually have uh, Senate Tower. I've never actually been inside before. Looking PvP terminal. Terminal. Uh, legacy vendors. We don't really need those. Uh, I think there's a cantina down here, and uh, yeah, here we go. And we'll get to a resting spot, and I'm probably gonna stop for a little while. Um. I think the uh, the vendor that I'm looking for is on the other side. So, yeah, here we go. Here's a trainer. Yeah, this is kind of like the um, the Man market sending out new tactics uh, all the time. Well, we're not going to use that. Ooh, cryo grenade. Uh, hurls a crowd grenade that freezes the target, dealing 70 to 90 and stunning it for 4 seconds. Pulse cannon, yeah, we're going to take that, and stock strike, which we're never going Stay to use, out there. hopefully. Mm, trooper, PvP vendor. No. Uh, yeah. I think they've moved everything around just a little bit. Uh, is this the cantina? Yeah, here's the rest of uh, Oh, wait, here's a... You always want to unlock the ones that are at your... Um, at the cantina. So that if you're going to stop, you can uh, accrue some uh, resting bonus. That's always kind of handy. Uh, stems vendor... Social, no. Equipment commendation vendor. Yay. Take a look at the stock. What can I get you? All right, so this is requires level 16. 
Uh, and as you can see, both of our weapons are actually uh, upgradable, so we won't actually have to worry about getting another uh, gun. Uh, this is a droid armor, which we won't need. Strength and endurance, we don't need. Uh, which I don't know why you get this, because you get one out of that starter bag. Um, yeah, these are all guns. Wow, those are those are really good pants. Um, and how much do I have? Uh, a pair. I'll, I'll buy a pair of those. Uh, yeah. So I guess at the first. Uh, your business. The first area they want, they really want to make sure that you get, uh, oh wow, really? Shorts? Oh, I just got to get better, better boots is all. Alright. Best place to buy. Durable, military grade supplies. <laughs> Alright, so we don't actually have anything that's uh, upgradable except our uh, power generator and our gun. So to upgrade our gun, we're going to need a new barrel, uh, and we need to do an aim and endurance barrel. Um, so we're level 13. We could almost just go on and buy one of these and make do with uh, our rating 28, but that's going to really, uh, it's basically going to be double the uh, uh, combat output, so yeah, that'd be pretty nice. Um, or we could just go on and grab it. I mean, that's not... Yeah, let's go on and grab one. Come back in one piece. Alright, uh, control, right, click. Uh... Alright, so right now, before we do this... Uh, our damage, if you look under, uh, right under main hand ranged, it says 39 to 59. So we're going to put this new barrel on. And it now is 54 to 82. So that is a significant jump. So, alright. So that's, uh, you know, um, upgrading in a nutshell. And we'll, uh, We'll probably come back and visit her uh, a couple more times and get some pieces here and there. Um, and of course, Jorgen, like, he's got that gun. Uh, that could probably go on and be upgraded, but I'm not going to worry about it. But, uh, but basically, you want to work on um, um, getting those uh, upgradable pieces and then just swapping stuff out as you can. Um, and then you, you don't really have to worry about quest items and stuff like that. Um, or at least that's how I do it anyway. But anyway, uh, that's uh, that's going to be it for now. Like I said, I've been uh, recording a good chunk, so um, yeah. Uh, I hope everybody uh, enjoys um, Star Wars The Old Republic with me, Foolish Mortal 42 and Sanjuri, our um, commando. So yeah. Uh, until next time, uh, thanks a ton for watching, and I hope everyone has a great day. See you in the next video.